A family out in Ohio now sounding the alarms in hopes of saving lives after a teenager died while trying to complete a challenge on TikTok, taking large amounts of Benadryl. Well, now his family wants to change the law. ABC's Lionel Moise explains. This morning, new warnings about the Benadryl challenge on TikTok after the death of a 13-year-old in Ohio. I'm going to do everything I can to try to make sure another child doesn't go through it. In the dangerous stunt, users take 12 to 14 pills of the antihistamine Benadryl in hopes of hallucinating. Jacob Stevens tried it with friends filming, but instead of hallucinating, his body started seizing. And they kind of just all come at one time and it was too much for his body. The family sharing this graphic image of Jacob in the hospital so others can see firsthand what the challenge did to him. The worst day of my life. He was on a ventilator for six days before doctors determined he would never wake up. No brain scan. There was nothing there. He said we could keep him on the vent. You know, he could lay there like that, but he will never open his eyes. He will never breathe on his own. Breathe on his own. Never do anything like smile. that. Smile. He'll never walk, talk. The FDA has warned about the challenge, saying it can lead to serious heart problems, seizures, coma, or even death, and has encouraged parents to lock up the drug. A search for the challenge on TikTok today shows no videos, instead directing you to a resource page with info on substance abuse. As for Jacob's family, they're now pushing lawmakers to impose age restrictions on medications like Benadryl. It's my life goal to, to make that happen. I'll, I'll, I'll go at it till, till I die. Jacob will be laid to rest tomorrow. Those who knew him say he put a smile on the faces of those around him. Lionel Moyes, ABC News, New York.